crews did a great job of bringing in uh, at least three guys who are going to really compete and, and do a good job for us. And Juan Pablo's resume speaks for itself. Um, Adam Crispin was always a guy that I liked um, when he played New England early on, and he's had a tough time with injuries. So the goal is get him healthy, and hopefully he can help produce. And then Chad is a guy, I think, who needed a, a fresh start. Um, you could tell he's probably a little stale in Toronto. And um, <clears throat> I, I think with Bruce and with the atmosphere we have here, he's the guy who's going to do really well for us. Will Pablo give you a different dimension? He's just dangerous. Um, the, the beauty of having Edson last year was once teams realized that what he was doing was, was real, it wasn't just luck, it wasn't just he, he was taking a few shots and they were going in. He, um, it takes a lot of pressure off the rest of us. And Juan Pablo's the same way. If he's in front of the goal, teams have to worry about him. And if they don't, he's going to score a lot of goals. And having more players like that on your team is helpful. It helps guys like me, it helps guys like David, it helps guys like Juninho. Um, <clears throat> helps us all be more creative and, and do our jobs better. You feel like, you, at least on paper, that you may have a, a more dangerous attack this year? Mm -hmm. I think we're deeper up front than we were last year. Um, we were overly dependent on Edson last year, and thankfully he didn't get hurt uh, seriously at some point, or we would have had some, some real problems. But this year we have a lot of depth, and um, we got a lot of good attacking options.